Welcome to Fragrance Culture Reviews and Chill. Today we will be discussing the house of Creed, and in particular, Creed Aventus. This house is been around for a very, very long time. And when that happens and they produce something that's so popular, people want to copy it. In this case, Creed Aventus is that bottle. Now, please keep in mind the bottle that I will be discussing today is the 120 ml Creed Aventus. This bottle has been discontinued and is no longer made. So what we have now is the Creed Aventus 100 ml bottle, which is what I show you now. So I will be putting these two side by side just to show you the differences, the 120 ml on the left and the 100 ml on the right. Regardless of which size, the copies and what I will show you are basically the same. So, as we go through it, I will show you what to look out for. And here we have the two Creed Aventus, fake on the left, real on the right. Both, both almost identical and the fake is exceptionally well done. So what I will sit, what I will start with is the detail and the roughness in the label. Some of them are very, very uh, soft uh, or sorry, they're not as detailed. Whereas this one here is very detailed and the label are identical. As you can see, all the lines there are very well put together. Whereas some of them are just a smooth finish and that's instantly a red flag. What I'm showing you here is that the label is very shiny on the right, which is a real and not shiny on the left. So that is one way to also tell. Again, some of the labels are very smooth, but these ones are the way it's supposed to be. So please look out for that. The other way to tell is the Creed sign. The one on the right and the left are well done, but some of them you can tell they are very poorly made on the fakes compared to the real one. Now, as we go over to the back, what you will be able to see, don't worry about the bubble that's on the left fake because that also happens on the real ones, okay? So that is not really a tell sign because you can tell. Now with the writing, the one on the left that I'm pointing to is quite thick. The font is different to the one on the right. So the one on the right is the real font and it's quite thin uh, and really pleasing to the eye. Whereas the one on the left is a lot thicker. And that is one way that you can definitely tell. Now, if you don't have the bottle side by side, it is very hard to tell. So I totally understand that. What we're looking at here is underneath the bottle. The Creed sign that's etched into the glass is very well read. You can see it, it's clear. It says Creed, made in France. It gives you the batch number. Um, and so, and then it says Paris. And it's all very thin, very nice. Whereas the one on the top, it's kind of bubbly. It's not very nice. Sometimes it doesn't even finish the word and you can't even read what it is. You can kind of tell, but it's not quite the same. So that's, that's another way you can tell. Now, what we're going to do is look at the caps. The caps are a very, very hard thing to tell these days because they make them so well. But what I will show you is the one on the left is the fake one and the one on the right is the real one. Now, what I will see is usually they're not very detailed, but in this case, these are so well made that they're extremely detailed in the cap. So in that sign that you can see, exceptionally well done. The, uh, the size of it, the weight of it is also identical. I really couldn't tell. It was really difficult to tell these two. At the end of the uh, sh uh, showing, I will show you how they fit as well. So here what we've got is the left and the right the different atomizers that also differs 
and here at the neck of the bottle on the left and the right you can tell that the left is a lot smoother it's a lot smaller but the one on the right is a lot squarer and a lot thicker that is another way to tell the atomizers also are different from being white on the left and black on the right so that is another way that's another thing that you can look out for Okay, now as I take the atom atomizers off, you will see a massive difference. But first we're going to look underneath. So underneath is also another sign. So especially in the Creed Aventus or the Creed copies, you will see that the fakes are a little bit shorter, whereas the real is a little bit longer, the white section inside. And as we go to the front, you will see also the sprayer is white on the fake and black on the real. So that's another one. So please keep these things in mind. As we move over to the inside, underneath the atomizer sprayer, this is where it all changes. And this is the main thing to look out for. The real one, as you will see, is a clear plastic. It is clear all the way around and you can see how different it is here. The fake one is totally different. So the real one you can see is all that clear plastic and you can see right through it with that little black part in the middle, whereas the fake is chrome uh, or a metal piece. They will either be silver or gold in chrome, whereas the real one is clear. Please keep that in mind. Now, as you can see, side by side, they are very different once you take the atomizers off. So this is an exceptionally well uh, made bottle, but they still have made it with the chrome uh, part inside. Now the real one, please take a look at this really carefully. This is going to, this even though this is a 120 mil bottle, you will still get this through the 100 mil bottles. Uh, and as you can see there, it's clear all the way through, even around. Whereas the fake ones, what they've done is they've put a, either a plastic chrome or gold or a metal piece that looks metal, and that is the fake. The problem is, is that Creed, um, no, so other companies will use that chrome part, which will confuse people, okay? But in Creed, they use clear plastic. Now, the lids will not fit, uh, the fake lid will not fit on the right, uh, which is the real bottle. That is one of the differences. That's one thing that you will tell. So if I take this off here and attempt to put this on the real bottle, you will see that they haven't been able to make that the same. So that's one tell sign. So it won't fit, okay? Whereas the real one will go onto the fake one, but it will be very, very loose. There you go. It actually, once it goes onto a real bottle, and if you do have a real bottle, you should feel a click. Ready? Click. That is how you know that you also have a real bottle. They will provide the click. Okay. So here we go. Now what you've got is the smell difference. The smell difference is very noticeable at first spray it actually smells very very good but that smell that scent of creed aventus will only last maybe 10 seconds before it dies off but yes it does smell decent if you open the lid but it will not last more than 10 to 20 seconds so that is how you know also the fake the fake bottle thank you so much for joining i hope this helped and please be careful